Hello, sports fans, and welcome back to another episode of Rick's Cards TTM Adventures. And uh, we've been off for a while. We've had all kinds of issues here at the home homestead, uh, from air conditioners going out, uh, not feeling well. So we're back. We're trying to get a little more consistency in, and uh, hopefully a little more consistent than the St. Louis Cardinals. Uh, yeah. So if you haven't already, hit the like button. Sub if you haven't. Comment on the end of this and let me know what you think. And with 154 subscribers, I appreciate you all. Let's get into it. Our first one coming out, uh, 3 of 3, and it took 10 days. It is uh, NBA star Mr. Keith Erickson. Keith Erickson played for the Suns, the Lakers, and uh, I really liked him. He liked me that side shot. It was my favorite of him. There he is signing three photos for me. I've got a little portable photo machine here that really comes in handy when I can't find a card from somebody. So that was my favorite right there. So thank you, Mr. Keith Erickson. Uh, three of three there on that. Coming up next, it took 55 days. He um, um, sent me a little note that uh, is $10 for card signing now, I guess. So he's upped his price. I, I sent him five. And he signed this uh, 89 Fleer for me. So uh, let me see if I can get our light here a little better. Let's see. Okay. I don't know if that's any better or not, but there it is. Yeah, he was a good left-handed pitcher. I really liked him. Had to get it. So thank you, Mr. Higuera. Remember, it's 10 bucks in the future for him. Coming up next, this one took only uh, 433 days. It's a two of two. Coming out of Fort Myers, Florida, is from Mr. Gary Allenson. Mr. Allenson signed two 81 tops for me. So it took a while, but he finally got back to me. Kind of like uh, how long it takes for them to get to a World Series, the Red Sox. <laughs> That's for my friend out there, Mike, Red Sox fan. Okay, next up, 13 days later, one of one. This one is from Gerald Alexander. Got his rated rookie card. Didn't have much of a career, kind of a utility player. Or not a utility player, but a middle relief pitcher. So uh, out of the Rangers organization. So I thank you, Mr. Alexander, for your autograph. Up next, this one is a second. I sent it out uh, a while back and came back uh, um, with the yellow tag. And then I sent another one. Didn't hear anything from him, so I found a new address, and this one took 20 days, 29 days, and it came back finally out of Tulsa, Oklahoma, and that's Johnny Ray. Johnny Ray signed this uh, um, 80, uh, what is this, 91 Donruss. He also signed a 89 Donruss, or yeah, 89 Donruss, and I've been off for a while, so I haven't got my cards figured out here. And uh, the 88 Donruss. So I thank you, Mr. Johnny Ray. Got him on the Angels on all those there. So I was hoping to get a pirate one, but you get what you get. So he took all my pirate cards and never gave them back. Coming up next, a uh, second one. I sent him the first one. He only signed one of three. So I figured it out. He only does one, I guess. So, And that last one, if you remember, he signed right across his forehead. This took 23 days. And coming out of Westchester, New York, former commissioner Faye Vinson. I really like this picture of him with the Major League hat on. He inscribed it to Rick Faye Vinson, Jr. So thank you, Mr. Commissioner, for your autograph. Finally got two from you. Speaking of another guy that only signs one, apparently, this took 11 days. It's a one of three. And it is Mr. Uh, Lenny Wilkins. Lenny Wilkins the USA coach for the hoops and of course Hall of Fame uh, basketball player or Seattle I believe yeah and um, I sent him one he only signed one of three or I sent him three he only signed one so I sent him this one back this is one I actually really wanted signed and he did it for me so I thank you Mr. Lenny Wilkins for your autograph he is a one of one so coming up next a former pop star Pop singer 
took 74 days. She's 90 years young. She signed four of four of those for me. And it is Ms. Connie Francis. Connie Francis signed four photos for me. This one here, I believe it says, Hi, Connie Francis. And this one says, To Rick, Love, Connie Francis. And she signed this one. Very beautiful lady. Where the boys are. Yeah, that was her song. <laughs> she signed that one. And the last but not least, Among My Souvenirs. Real story, volume one. Copy of, of, of her book. To Rick, Love, Connie Francis. So I thank you, Miss Connie Francis, for your autograph. That took 74 days. Coming up next out of Hockey Sensation. Took 348 days, a one of one out of Denver, Colorado. Jacques Claudier. Claudier? Claudier. Claudier, I'm going to say Claudier. So Jacques Claudier signed this one of one on 89.90 tops for me. So thank you, Mr. Claudier, for your autograph. One of my few hockeys. Up next, 37 days later, this one's a one of one. It took 37 days, like I say. Steve Bouchel signed this 88 Donruss for me. Steve Bouchel. I've tried him a couple of times, and he finally came, came back to me. He apparently is maybe a one of one, so that could have been the trouble. Up next, a card that took uh, 551 days. Kevin Fagan signed this for me. Defensive end for the 49ers out of Atlanta Metro. Sign this one of one. Sign this 90 Pro set for me. So I thank you, Mr. Kevin Fagan. He, he sent that back to me, by the way, in a uh, in a protective uh, cover. So next up, another long one. 438 days. And uh, let's see here. Get out of here. It is another um, football. Mike Haynes signed this. Uh, two of two. Like I said, it took 438 days. He signed a 81 tops and a 79 tops. All pro. Mr. Mike Haynes. So I thank you, sir, for your autograph. All pro. I'm not sure if he's in the Hall of Fame or not. Let me know, Mike. <laughs> Okay, up next, I've sent her a couple, uh, three photos. She only sends one back, so she must be a one of one. And it took 88 days, Mr. Miss Annika Sorensen, one of the best female pro golfers ever, I would say. And um, she signed this one, which I really liked. It's pretty. So was she. <laughs> so, yes, I got her finally. I got her a couple times now. Up next, Hall of Fame. Hall of Famer. Um, <clears throat> it's a, It took 14 days. Three-time Super Bowl GM Hall of Famer, Mr. Ron Wolf. Mr. Wolf had, headed up those Packer teams. He signed this uh, uh, 2000 police card, actually. It's a policeman from the Packer from uh, uh, Green Bay. And he also signed my um, autograph card. So I thank you, Mr. Ron Wolf, uh, GM, my first GM for uh, for football. He also signed, top it off, two two index cards. So I thank you, Mr. Ron Wolf, for your autograph. So last not, but not least, we'll finish it up with a Cardinal. This took 30 days. It's a two of two coming out of Fort Myers, Florida. And this was signed by Julian Javier. If you're any fan of the 60s, you know who the second baseman for the Cardinals was Julian Javier. Javi, still around, um, coming to St. Louis every once in a while for the specials they have. He signed this uh, 69 tops, and he signed this 
autograph card and inscribed it 6467 World Series. So I thank you, Mr. Javier, for your autograph. And I thank all my participants that signed their, their names to my cards today and photos. And I thank you for watching. And uh, please subscribe, comment, and like. And uh, until we see you again, always hustle.